All right, now we're on Virgo. I think that'll be my last one for tonight. Ooh, what is this popping out of nowhere? Okay. So finding strength and courage, Virgo. For someone, you might be designing something, okay? I'm getting sonar. This could be like the lover's knot unraveling. Okay, let's see what that is. All right, now what I want to say, Virgo, is there is this energy that wants to find balance and stability. Now that could be the Uranus retrograde, no, Uranus going direct here in 2023. All right, so, but I feel like you've gotten comfortable with those surprises that came in 2022, okay. So now for some of you, that could have felt like something unraveled, okay? And this could represent a resistance to something, whatever that is. That could be love, work, anything. Now, I'm getting taffy. You know how when taffy is spin, spinning, right? Okay, so it could be like two people trying to come out uh, on the sweeter side of life. Okay, now for some of you, it's like uh, being solo and continuing to be solo. Three, six, and nine, right? Three, six, and nine. Oh, um, Leo got a lot of... Uh, Leo got a lot of nine, so you might be coming together with a Leo, or this could be shoring up your own energy in 2023. Now, for some of you, you could have come across some energy that felt like a pirate, whatever that uh, means to you. Okay, pirating energy. Okay, so, and it, it could have caused you to go within here. Okay, so there is a transformation here. For some of you, this is a Scorpio that you're calling in. For some of you, it's a Leo. What to do, what to do. In this process, there is a transformation happening, whether you end up with those people or not. That's what I'm getting. Okay, now for some of you, you could have changed how you look even on the outside. 
and how you present yourself to the world could be transforming. Now, for some of you, this is like a Trying to go within to figure out what pathway you're going to go on this time. Looking forward through your inner world, your inner being. Okay, so coming across the water dragon. I could be crossing the water dragon, so it could be two different kinds of energies coming together. Six, looking into your six-dimensional self for the answers on how to harmonize with this energy. Asking, right, the right questions and spirit answering your calls. Some of you will find inspiration through music. This is you calling the water sign for some of you. This could be also playing those, the going through the emotional scale and learning how to uh, fine tune, moving with that energy, your emotions in 2023, finding balance through that. Woo, you got a couple of butterflies here. So I feel like it's two people transforming through entanglement or connection. And what is this? For some of you, it's a match. Now, this came up in Aries reading, too. What was that? It's like balancing out. Also, it's like revealing a new side, your inner world, your emotions. Ooh, 40 and 4. For some of you, that could represent uh, you connecting with your spirituality again here. Okay. Like looking into the past to bring into the future could be a past life connection with either Gemini or Libra for some of you. Okay. It's like you called this person. Here's that kind of, now for some of you, again, this is like you went down the spiral to understand certain energies and you're going to rise up. Yeah, this could be like past life soulmate and then going down the spiral to understand and then rising up. Okay. Okay. see what the message is from that person. You are my everything and never give up. Okay. Your kisses make my heart beat faster. For some of you, it's someone you've been connected to. I believe in you. What is this? 
They are the perfect blend. Ooh, didn't Aries get that? Or was that Taurus? Okay, today will be a damn fine day. Okay, being determined to bring in 2023 in the way you desire. Okay. I'll be the wind, the rain, and the sunset, the light on your door to show that you're home. The velvet underground, I'll be your mirror. Okay, so there could have been some mirroring energy here, right? <laughs> All right, so, uh, okay. So, you know what? Uh, I've got the Scrabble here, so let's do some Scrabble then. Okay. So there could be like um, initials or a secret message or I'll give you what I pick up and then you, you pick up your own stuff, okay? Okay. Leo. Ra. Sun. The sun transit is going through Capricorn. So it might be Capricorn or Cancer. Okay. And someone who laughs a lot. LOL is here. Okay. Nah. Ooh. AKI. In the fall. Someone who has a Kia. I got Ja Rule, who, whatever that is. Okay. Oh, okay. Ja Rule, the music. Okay. Okay. Um, I got uh, Lee, L-I, Lee Lee. Quan. Quan. J. J. -A. There's no Y here, but I keep picking up Y. Okay, so that would be Quan Yin and then uh, J. J. A. Y. J. A. L. Could be someone Asian, Japanese. Nat Okay, that's all I pick up. I'll leave you with that. Thank you.